Hello, my name is Mrs. Champley Potter and I'm the Head of Languages at St. Ivo Academy. Thank you very much for watching this presentation. If you have any questions, my email address is on the last slide. Thank you. We offer two GCSE courses at St. Ivo Academy, French and German. Uh, some fascinating facts about languages. And some more. I must admit, I didn't know what cryptophasia was. So languages not only make students better learners, but also more employable with more employers looking for school leavers uh, with language skills at all levels. Why are language skills so, uh, so desired? Well, they equip us with better communication skills and improve how we express ourselves in our own language. Language learners also uh, are more likely to take calculated risks to try something new, uh, even if it isn't perfect. Public speaking may not come naturally to most of us, but language learners do get used to speaking in front of others, which in turn improves our public speaking skills. Language learners develop an ability to adapt, communicate flexibly and comfortably with others. We also become more open to and understanding of others. The French team includes myself, uh, Mrs. Jones, Miss Lee, our Key Stage 3 coordinator and Mr. O'Brien. German GCSE classes are taught by Mrs. Moore, our German Key Stage 3 coordinator and Mr. Porter. So why choose GCC uh, at St Ivo? Well, our teaching staff are all highly qualified, experienced teachers. Our GCC results are very good. 88% of students gaining grade four or above and 28% of students grade, uh, gaining grade seven or above in French. Our courses are well structured and we offer a range of materials to help students progress. Textbooks pass paper booklets in all, uh, in all skills and we subscribe to a number of sites available to students such as ExamPro, GCSE Pod and so on. We're also very lucky to have a foreign language assistant in the team who enhances classroom teaching with weekly speaking sessions. The course carries on from what students have done in year nine. The transition is therefore very smooth and students start year 10 with a very good understanding of what is required to succeed in the different skills. In year 10, we study topics such as where you live, describing your region, national and foreign travel and holidays. 
In year 11, we look to the future, both studies and jobs. We also study national and international social and environmental concerns. The main emphasis, however, throughout the final year of the course is to improve student exam technique and equip them with skills which will maximise their exam potential. The course is examined at the end of year 11 and there are four exam papers. Paper one is listening, paper two speaking, which is conducted with your classroom teacher. Paper three, reading, and paper four, writing. Each paper has equal weighting of 25% of the final grade. Many thanks for watching this presentation. If you have any questions, please don't hesitate contact to contact me. Thank you.